So I'm just going to show you how to use the baseball bat. Um, there's three keys to it. Um, mainly is keeping your hands together and like, you have a good uh, like form. You want to keep your knuckles lined up. A lot of people like rap like this. You can tell we, like, we don't know how to really swing a bat. Or they rap like this or they're too far like this. And, like, to properly stay inside of the baseball, you have to line up your knuckles. It just like, it just, like works together like A and B. Uh, three things you really want to work on is your stance. You want to make sure that you have a proper form. Uh, the second one would be like your power, so you want to use your leg and extend the back half. And the third one would be a follow through. A lot of people, uh, you might see they follow through like this, or you know, it's kind of weird, but the best way is to follow high. Like that's how you get your power, and that's how you get like, like that's how you have to walk the distance. Uh, so I'll just show you just a couple things. Uh, when you take them, when you get in your stance, you want to make sure you're in a comfortable position, uh, right by shoulder width apart. Uh, it depends on like where you like, you know, like some people like their hands down here, but me, I like my hands high. I like, just feel like I feel more strong and feel like it's easy to drop the barrel down on the ball instead of coming from down here and then just trying to meet the ball everywhere. Uh, and then two, I like to have my legs bent, you know. Uh, I'm open a little bit. Just, it makes me just like see the ball better, like all speed, like you no know, curve balls and everything. If I'm open a little bit, I just can see the ball, like coming in better. If I'm, if I'm closed off, it's kind of hard for like, you know, a right, a right hand pitch. It's kind of hard for me to tell if it's coming in or like, away from me. But if I'm open, I can see like, you know, if it's coming inside or out. I have my hand tied, so. If it is inside of the step, and I drop my hands and keep my follow through. And the third thing you want to work on is the follow through. That's the most important part. A lot of people get to contact and then they just don't finish the swing and they just end up not hitting the ball as hard as they could. But if you finish it, you get to contact, you push through it with your back hand. That's the biggest thing, push, push through with your back hand. It makes you like hit the ball harder. Yeah.